hello students in this video we will be discussing what is choked flow in case of nozzle so we are taking a converging nozzle at point 2 these are the two areas we have taken entry and exit at exit point uh, we have provided a valve at the nozzle so we will be discussing these figures in this uh, uh, video uh, the va the valve is provided at the exit of the noble. The back pressure that is acting on the flow is taken as PB. The expansion in nozzle is taken as P1 to PB. That means P1 is the original pressure that is at the entry point of the nozzle. And PB is the back pressure acting on the flow in the backward direction. Initially... PB is equals to P1 that means there will be no flow when there will be no flow then P1 will be equals to PB but as the back pressure is reduced mass flow rate increases that means when the back pressure is slightly reduced the flow through the nozzle increases mass flow rate increases now due to reduction in back pressure a situation comes when pressure ratio is equal to critical pressure ratio and the mass flow rate is maximum. Jab, when we will keep reducing the back pressure, a situation will come when the mass flow rate will be maximum. But if we now further uh, reduce the back pressure, then there will be no effect on the mass flow rate. Okay. So if the flow is taking place through here and we keep reducing the keep reducing the back pressure then the flow rate will be increasing but if we keep reducing it then there will be a point where the flow will be maximum and there will be no effect on the flow further reduction in back pressure beyond critical pressure no effect on mass flow rate so such conditions is called as choked flow or critical flow under these conditions the flow is said to be choked flow and the nozzle which operating in the maximum flow rate condition is called as choked flow nozzle and uh, here in this diagram there are three states shown a c and d a state is that state in which back pressure is greater than critical pressure state 2 back pressure is equals to critical pressure state 3 back pressure is less than critical pressure so these are the states a b and c shown in this diagram here there is one more thing that i would like to tell you as we discussed here that uh, if uh, Due to reduction in back pressure, the mass flow rate is maximum at a certain situation. But if we keep increasing also the back pressure, there comes a certain uh, point where the uh, mass flow rate uh, will again be maximum. But in this video, we are discussing about what is choked flow. So I have tell you that when further reduction in back pressure does not lead to any effect on the mass flow rate, then it is called as choked flow. And the nozzle through which the flow is taking place is called as choked flow nozzle. I hope this video was useful. Thank you so much.